everyone. I'm lost my hat already. <laughs> Hey, hi everyone, it's lovely to see you. Welcome to Number Fun Live. I'm Dave Godfrey. And I'm Cheeky Monkey. <laughs> Hiya! <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh, there you are. Hiding behind the glasses. <laughs> I dropped them too. <laughs> oh no. Everything's been dropped already this morning. Oh, I hope we can have loads of fun today. Why have you got your hat on? Well, the thing is, I've got my hat on and my special wig because whenever I see numbers, they like turn me into the number dance machine. The number dance machine. <laughs> <laughs> it is. And you know, I've got my special number from waistcoat here. And whenever I um, have my heart here, I press my heart, it makes my heart squeak. Because <laughs> I just love numbers so much. Anyway, hope, you, hope you're loving numbers today. Um, we're here to help you guys have loads of fun and do some super cool mathematics at home today. And what are we doing? What we're doing? Well, we've got, we got some great videos. We've got some good news. I'm going to tell you some good news in a minute. Um, we've got some songs, got my mathematical adventures. Hey, I'm looking forward to it. Well, so am I. I'm looking forward to it. We're going to start with some shout outs. You ready for your waves? I'm ready. <laughs> okay, here's the waves. We're going to have big, a big wave to uh, Rosie, Rosina and Benjamin. Wave! Thank you very much for our chocolates. They were just really appreciated. We had a little, we had a little delivery. We did. We did, which is very kind because we're here by ourselves in the Number Fun studio and nobody else around all the time. So it's very nice to have a little bit of a, a, bit of a thank you. So thank you for that. And uh, Emma and Hannah in Northern Ireland. What well, happened? to you. Thank you for your, your pictures this morning. We'll see those on Monday. And thank you to everybody else who's been sending us lovely, lovely messages. I've got some news. Yeah, what's the news? What's the news? Well, the news is Adam managed to find you. He did indeed. <laughs> and actually, the first place you were hiding was in the Knickers song. Knickers! <laughs> it was. So well done all of you who managed to find Cheeky Monkey in the Knickers song. He's going to be hiding in, he's still hiding in a couple of other ones. Roaring success. Oh, that's a clue. And, uh, uh, jelly. And jelly is another clue. And there's another one for this, um, another uh, video going online with you today, Cheeky Monkey. Dance. The word dance in it. Oh, we've got funky monkey finger dances, all sorts of dance songs. And so maybe you need to search through some dance ones. And But the other thing, some good news is this. We've just put up on the Number Fun portal as a portal exclusive. A portal exclusive indeed. All the machines and the tractors on Number Fun Farm. I need my board. <laughs> you need your board, okay. Banana chuck. <laughs> okay, there you are. <laughs> oh dear. And here's, here's num your cheeky monkey's board for today. It's got lots of numbers on it. It has, because numbers are absolutely everywhere. Can you spot some numbers? Can you, s can you shout out a number or two that you can see? Seven. <laughs> seven. Oh, I can see seven up here. Seventy-seven. Oh, which is seven tens and seven ones. These are like the, the numerals we can see. One pound. There's one there, one pound, which is actually 100 pence. We've got three, 135, nine. There's a three on the dice. So just numbers are all around us, everywhere in the environment. 21. Oh, that's right. It's a bit like a train, doesn't it? For two tens and a one. Five. And um, what's this one down here? 19. 19. So loads of numbers. They're all very odd. They're all very odd? Yeah. Oh, you're right. Actually, these are all odd numbers. Oh, I love numbers. They're everywhere. Oh, oh, I'm getting used to him dropping things. I managed to catch that one. It's time to do some dancing. <laughs> it is time to do some dancing because today we're going to have loads of fun doing the dance. Oh, drop your hat. I'm dropping my hat. Oh, dear. Here's the Keep Fit song. Let's get ourselves moving and dancing this morning. It's you and Sue, innit? It is me and Sue. Put a smile on your face. Put the twinkle in your toes. Put the frizz back in your hair. Number fun, keep it song. Do your exercising as you sing along. This is the number fun, keep it song. Do your exercising as you sing along. Walk forwards, walk backwards, walk forwards, walk backwards, walk forwards, walk backwards, and do it to the funky beat. 
right now to the left now to the right now to the left now to the right now and do it to the funky beat cause this is the number fun keep it song do your exercising as you sing along this is the number fun keep it song do your exercising as you sing along crawl under walk over crawl under walk over crawl under walk over and do it to the funky beat move closer apart now move closer apart now move closer apart now and do it to the funky beat cause this is the number fun keep it song do your exercising as you sing along this is the number fun keep it song do your exercising as you sing along roll turn stretch bend roll turn stretch bend roll turn stretch bend and do it to the funky beat let's try that again roll turn stretch bend roll turn stretch bend roll turn stretch bend and do it to the funky beat because this is the number fun keep it song do your exercising as you sing along this is the number fun keep it song do your exercising as you sing along hey we'll be back <laughs> we're back indeed oh we've just, we've just had a a message from Central Command. Oh, we didn't have a mic on. Well, the white wasn't set up for this bit. I apologise, but I was talking away in the studio here about this. This is our mathematical adventure. It was, um, it's basically an audio book about 18 minutes long. It tells the story of what happens when Farmer Pete had his 10 sheep and they kept getting lost from the sheep pen. Mick the mechanic. Mick the mechanic was there and Farmer Summer. She's married to Farmer Pete. Those two uh, have a daughter called Alice and they live on Number Fun Farm. And Lola. And Lola as well. So that storybook is now live on the Number Fun portal. You'll find it on the homepage. So we'll check that out a bit later. I apologise for the lack of sound on that. I, I need the racetrack. Oh, you need the racetrack. Where's your flag? I, I don't... I got confused. You got confused. <laughs> it is racetrack flags, which is our signal that the racetrack time. Because if you remember, we've been sending out our special correspondent, the pig, to find out what's going on with our multiples, our magnificent multiples training course. Here's what he came back with this today. He's looking at numbers. He is indeed. Ooh, 20. 15. Blue cone, 13. Oh, that's very odd. <laughs> I think you might have found out what's going on. Well, there's a 10. There's a 5. Oh, Piggy, what are we going to do? He's gone, I stepped on 1. Oh, he's going to the cones. 3, 5, 7. It's all the odd numbers. <laughs> he is, he's counting on the odd numbers, isn't he? 11, 13, 15. 17, 19. Oh, he's a hat! He thinks the cone's a hat! What's he doing now? Oh, he's got a cone as a nose! Oh. Thank you, Mr. Piggy. So there's definitely some odd numbers going on there. You know, as next week we're going to send the sheep around there and the pig and the bear and all our number fun characters. In fact, we've got a really interesting week next week. Why? Well, because we've got just so much lined up. We're going to do quite, quite a lot of stuff on time um, and the concept of time. But we've got some really interesting people on, uh, on the 30-second challenge. Here's one of them. Ooh. 
Jay Comfrey from BT Sport. <laughs> it's Jay Comfrey from BT Sport. He's doing one of our 30 second challenges. Isn't, isn't that wonderful? Thank you, Jake. And all the other lovely people, like we've got Gareth, or like we've got Anthony, my buddy, is going to do it today. And we've got Mohammed um, Darwood, who's a teacher in Bolton. He's doing it next week as well. So we've got loads of great people for that next week. Anyway, it's time to find out what I did with my mathematical adventure. And you know what I thought I'd do today is I'd show you exactly what the contestants will do next week on our multiples training course. So here it is. Mathematical adventures around the house. Here is the magnificent multiples training course. Brilliant. What's going to happen? The contestant will take the ball from the chair over to the centre of the clock. The clock has got an hour hand and a minute hand. At the moment it says seven o'clock. There's 12 of the cones. I'm going to count back to start with 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. Counting back in multiples of 1. Then we're going to count on in multiples of 5. Because on the feet, 5 toes. So we're going to go 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. Around the clock, can you see all these numbers? Turn me into a number dance machine. <laughs> well, that was strange. So we've counted back in multiples of one and on in multiples of five. Next bit is multiples of two. So the contestant will pick up a bucket. In here are beanie bags and oh, there's a hamster and a chicken. So what will happen is the, the contestant will count in multiples of two. So they'll go two, four, six, and I've laid the rest out for you so you can see it's multiples of two. Once we've gone down there, we're now in multiples of 10. So here we're going to use our hands, our fingers. So we're going to go 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, all the way around to 100. So we're seeing one pair of hands, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Numbers are everywhere. Let's celebrate. Machine. <laughs> that was strange again. Right, next thing. The contestant will pick up the hopper and they'll go, oh, oh, oh. I can see the number two. They'll bounce around. The Colchester United flag. Go full circle around there. Then they're going to come to this section. Now the odd numbers are highlighted by the blue cone. So it's going to be one. They're going to, going to, they're going to count in odd numbers. One, three, five, seven, and it'll come on like that. So I've got 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Numbers turn me into a number dance machine. Oh, that's amazing. The last part, we're going to count back in multiples of a number. In this case, multiples of seven. So we're going to count back from 84 in sevens. I'm going to put a coin on each number. So 84, 77, 70, 63, 56, 49, 42, 35, 28, 21, 14, seven and zero. Then to finish, the contestant picks up the tennis racket and runs over and has and goes through all the numbers here like one two three four five six seven and four and have to knock the ball up. <laughs> Did you see it? The thing is, wherever I get see numbers, it just turns me into a number dance machine. I love it. So <laughs> that's my. So ever since we've started Number Fun Live, we've had that the number dance machine bit at the beginning of our program. Uh, so that's where it comes from. It comes from the number dance machine song. In fact, I've, <laughs> I've lost my hat. We're we're going to show you the video in a minute, and I know a lot of you have watched it on the Number Fun portal already. Um, but 
the Number Thance Machine song was inspired by this book, Nigel's Numberless World. And in, in the story, basically, Nigel magics away all the numbers in the world and suddenly it was chaos. Nobody knew what house number they lived at. Nobody, when they were trying to cook, knew what the temperature was in the cooker. Oh dear. <laughs> so things got burnt. And when you play football, nobody knew how many goals had been scored. It was like chaos without numbers. And But their numbers are just so helpful because they really help us understand our world and and just everywhere. I love it. <laughs> I love it as well. So here's the number dance machine. So do sing along. You'll know some of the tune now. No, it's not. <laughs> were no numbers, there's things I couldn't do. Like what? I couldn't tell what time it is, or bake a cake or two. Or three. I couldn't say how old I am, or when my birthday's due. Really old. I couldn't buy a lollipop, or do a number dance for you. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Numbers are the numbers, there's loads that I can do. Like what? I can tell what time it is and bake a cake or two. Or nine. I can say how old I am and when my birthday's due. 74. I can buy a lollipop. Numbers, numbers, I, I love, love you. you. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Numbers are everywhere. Let's flag down. <laughs> Where are you? Oh, I'm here. <laughs> well done. Oh, I hope you like that. I just think numbers are fantastic. We need them all the time and they're absolutely everywhere around us. They are. <laughs> they are indeed. So we can see numerals but we can also see a number numbers of things. So that's brilliant. So let's just see if there's any numbers today in the special pictures that you've been sending us. Well hey, Clara. <laughs> oh, Clara's got an egg collection machine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. She's got there. Oh, brilliant. And another excellent... Oh, here's Emma. She's shooting things down her excellent egg, egg collection machine too. <laughs> oh. We're loving that, Emma. Brilliant idea. Isabella. Oh, lo we love the way Isabella is playing with her tens frame with her egg box. I'm love glad you got an egg box. And look at those tens frame versions of coins on the floor. I'm loving it. I'm loving it as well. Oh, here's Petra. She's trying the 30 second challenge that my mum okay. did yesterday. Managed to do 10. Good job. Do Even 10. Well done, Petra. You managed to do 10. And we also had Leah did it as well. How many did Leah manage? To, how many numbers did I? Ten. Good girl. Oh, thank you so much for those things you're sending Number in. Number fun monster challenges. 
So here's today's mon number fun monster challenges. Our first challenge is, can you turn yourself into a number dance machine? You know, sometimes... Yeah, that, that, like T-shirts. Like T-shirts, yeah. So sometimes when we go to schools, uh, we have special number days and children dress up in T-shirts with loads of numbers on and, and have special number hats or football shirts with numbers on the back. Um, so I wonder whether, can you turn yourself into a number dance machine and look as ridiculous as I did in that video? <laughs> You can. <laughs> they can, I'm sure. So it'd be great if you had a go at that one. Second thing to do is um, to go on a number hunt and as the number dance machine and go and find some super cool numbers around your home. And if you go to the number fun portal, you'll find in the age three to five section, there's the number dance machine song. You'll find there's a, uh, with the parent ideas pack on there, there's various activity ideas on there and they include maybe going and finding numbers around your home and having a little bit of a number checklist and having lots of fun there. In a moment, I'm just going to show you Ailey's thing as well. What's he doing? Well, he's going to work with bigger numbers. So if you, on the Nugget Challenge, in the 9 to 11 age range bit, there's a, a song here called Lumber Licking Logs. So if you click on there, that takes you to a song that's got all about reading really, really big numbers. So I encourage you to check that out as well. And just here's the home page. Oh, there's the story. And there's the story I mentioned earlier on. So if it, oh, this is the Parent Portal homepage. There's the audio book. So please do go and check that out. The 32nd challenge, not time for the next one. Your buddy. <laughs> my buddy, my really good buddy, who I think is amazing. It's Anthony Reddy. And he's he's going to come and do a 30-second challenge. And uh, is he old? Yes, he's, he's ancient. <laughs> and you'll see what he's doing. He's, he's, he's having to practice this, you see. His 30-second his challenge. He's having to practice it in a minute. So here we go. I wonder whether you can do this. <laughs> Numbers. No, hold on. Hold seconds? on, hold on. <laughs> that, that's your, that's my mum. That's the wrong monster challenge. <laughs> oh dear, oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Hold on, we need to get the monster challenge, the 31. I'm, I apologise that for that. Anthony's not quite that old. He is old though. He is very old, um, but he's not quite that old. <laughs> I'm just heading for it. Ah, it's in the wrong place. Oh dear, oh dear. I'm going on here. You're making lots of mistakes. I think I'm blaming you today. Why me? Well, <laughs> because, well, I think um, you're the one who you're the one who gets me ev every day when I'm trying to get sorted out. You're the one who's making little problems. Thank you, Mum. Hello, everybody. My name's Anthony Reddy. Like Dave, I'm a maths consultant and a maths trainer. I've been asked to set you a 30-second challenge. So my 30-second challenge is to use this chair and to stand, sit down and stand up as many times as possible as I can do in 30 seconds. I've got a timer set here, I'm just going to about to press play, let's see how many I can do in 30 seconds. So three, two, one, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39. There we go. I was quite tiring. What that? I managed 39 um, stand-up and sit-downs uh, in one minute. Let's see how many you can do. That was amazing. Thank you, Anthony. Is it going well, Dave? <laughs> uh, we've had one or two slight minor slip-ups this morning. Oh, dear. <laughs> but anyway, uh, <laughs> he doesn't look quite as old as your mum. <laughs> you know, he's not quite as old as my mum. Anyway, Ailey, what are you here for? Oh, I've got a nugget suggestion, Dave. Oh, that's right. So these are, these are little number fun nugget suggestions up here for uh, children in Key Stage 2 off the back of today. I wanted to look at big numbers, Dave. Oh, that's right. I've already pointed them on the on the portal to Lumber Licking Logs, which is about reading really, really, really big numbers. Oh, I've got loads of ideas, Dave. On this sheet. On the sheet. That one. No, that one. That one on there. <laughs> okay. Well, we, we'll check that out. Thank you. Bye. <laughs> right. So... If you're in, if you're in key stage two, do check out uh, Ailey's Nugget Challenge. I'm back. I'm all right. You're you're all right. 
goodness me, chaos. Chaos indeed. Oh my goodness. Well, do you know what's happening next week? Jake Humphries here. Jake Humphries is here on Monday doing his 30 second challenge. I'm going to get that one right. You, you're going to sort that video out right? Yeah. Okay, that's good. And what else are we doing? Uh, we, we got the sheep. Oh, the sheep. Oh, the, look, there's the sheep going around. He's, he's going around the Colchester United flag there. It's going to be so much fun. In, indeed it is. We hope you all have a super fantastic mega mathematical weekend. Go and be a number dance machine. Go and recognise numbers everywhere. Everywhere in the environment. Everywhere in the environment. Everywhere you go. So I hope you love it. And we're going to finish today <laughs> with... Uh, and do send us an email. Anything over the weekend, we'd love to hear from you. And we'll be back on Monday morning at 10 o'clock. We're going to finish with a video actually of me in school doing the number dance machine. So as we do it, my encouragement to you is to see if you can spot numbers where you are, if you're in your sitting room or wherever you are, see if you can find some numbers like I do in the song. So this is me with the, child the children at Heweth Primary School here in York. And we look forward to seeing you very soon. Bye! <laughs> If there were no numbers, there's things I couldn't do. I couldn't tell what time it is, or bake a cake or two. I couldn't say how old I am, or when my birthday's due. I couldn't buy a lollipop, or do a number that's for you. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Numbers are Numbers, there's loads that I can do. I can tell what time it is and bake a cake or two. Or nine. I can say how old I am and when my birthday's due. 74. I can buy a lollipop. Numbers, numbers, I, I love, love you. you. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Numbers are everywhere. Let's celebrate. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Bye. Have a lovely weekend. Bye.